Hey, it's Jason from EnlightenedWebMastery.com. Today we're going to talk about how to upgrade to WordPress version 2.8. Now, the makers of WordPress have made this process incredibly simple. I mean, it's pretty much anybody can do it. All you have to do is just click a few buttons. But there's still little nuances and things you need to be pay attention to to make sure you don't mess anything up. Now, I got to say, if you're upgrading from a version of WordPress 2.6 or under, then I want you to check out this article that I wrote on my website. Open up your browser and type in enlightenwebmastery.com forward slash upgrade dash your dash WordPress dash install. Otherwise, I'm going to go ahead and show you the three step workflow from upgrading from WordPress 2.7 to WordPress 2.8. Step one back up your database. This is very important. If something goes wrong, you could lose your data, plugin could get corrupted. You never really know what's going to happen until it happens. So, back up your database. If you don't already do this or don't know how, I read a, wrote an article that you should check out. Just visit enlightenedwebmastery.com forward slash backup dash WordPress dash database. If you don't already have the backup plugin installed, then I want you to go ahead and pause this video, visit the link, and complete the tutorial. Whenever you're finished, come back and join me. Alright, what you need to do now is log into your dashboard, scroll down under tools, and then I want you to click the backup option. Once you do that, near the top you're going to see a screen that looks like this. You're going to have the option to save the server, download to your computer, or email a backup. Now inside the training I just mentioned earlier, I teach you how to set this up so you automatically get your backups emailed to you. But right now what we want to do is just download it directly to our computer because if something goes wrong, we're going to have to upload it from our computer anyway. So click that and then choose backup now. Then you're going to see a little screen similar to this where you get the progress. Once it's finished, it's going to look, show a little pop-up and then you just click the save file. Next, what you need to do is click that little button at the top that says WordPress 2.8 is available. Please update now. This takes us to step two. Once you click that link, you're going to get this option. And what I want you to do is click upgrade automatically. This is a one-step process that it just does the whole thing for you. Now, if you remember earlier in the video, I mentioned a link I wanted you to click if you were upgrading from an earlier version of WordPress, such as 2.6 or lower. That's the process this one little tool does for you automatically now. Just one click of a button, which is really, really cool and really great. So after you click the upgrade automatically, you're going to have to put in your FTP login information. This is not the login you use to log into your dashboard. This is the login you use to connect to the website via your FTP account. So go ahead and type in your host name, your username, and your password, and make sure the connection type is set to FTP, and then click Proceed. Now what's going to happen is your screen is going to seem to just freeze up and you're going to think nothing's happening. Don't panic. Don't close the site or go back or anything else crazy. Just sit still and relax. It'll probably take about 60 seconds to maybe two or three minutes and then you'll see this screen will load up and you'll be fine. So what it does is it unpacks the update, verifies everything, installs it, upgrades your database, and then it gives you this little message that says WordPress upgraded successfully. Now again, it's going to look like it's hung up, but it's not. So just leave it alone and all will be well. And that takes us to the final step, and that is test. What I want you to do is make sure your plugins are working, nothing's going crazy or anything like that. If it is, you're going to have to revert, go back to an earlier version. So I hope you've enjoyed this video, and stay tuned and subscribe to my channel. I'm going to be posting some new videos soon, showing in detail the new features of WordPress 2.8 and how best to go about using them. So you're not going to want to miss this stuff, so subscribe to my channel. That way you'll get a little email in your inbox telling you when the new videos are ready, so you can just click that and see the videos instantly instead of having to search for them or any of this other stuff. So until then, I'll talk to you soon. Oh, and one more thing. If you happen to be new to WordPress and you don't really have everything figured out, you're still struggling with some of the user interface problems, or you're having a little hard time trying to figure out where stuff is and how best to start working on things, I created a course called WordPress Foundations, which you can find out more about by visiting WordPressFoundations.com. In the course, I take you from beginning, not really knowing what a blog is or how to use the interface, all the way to having your site up, ready, and running with search engine optimization, content creation strategies, and stuff like that. I explain how to do things like add little Twitter updates to your blog and enhance your blog through widgets, changing themes, working with your posts, and stuff like that. So if you're interested in that, you might want to check it out. If you're a WordPress guru who's been using it for a year or two, it's obviously not for you. It's mainly aimed at people starting up their first blog, understanding the workflow and everything inherent inside of using WordPress, which is one of my favorite blogging platforms available. 
So again, click the subscribe to channel box, that way you get a little email in your inbox telling you when I post some new videos, you can find out about all the latest features and start implementing them today. So again, this is Jason, I'll talk to you soon.